Depending on your previous CAD experience, you may have noticed that the default orientation of geometry differs from product to product. Now, 2D CAD is generally set up for civil engineering, so it defaults to the top plane, using the ground as the main reference, where 3D CAD products differ from a variety of reasons. But either way, these factors are going to affect the outcome of data translation. When you're sharing SOLIDWORKS data with the 3D Experience platform, it's important to consider these factors and set yourself up for success. You can do that by setting the SOLIDWORKS view orientation to up by default. Now SOLIDWORKS defaults to the front plane with the Z facing out towards the user. Where the 3D Experience platform defaults to the top plane with Z facing up. This can add a layer of inconvenience when sharing data created in SOLIDWORKS with any of the X apps. Now they slipped this little nugget into SOLIDWORKS 2020 and it totally slipped under my radar. But now there's more reason than ever to be aware of it. The new setting was added to the view orientation dialog. You can hit your spacebar to get there. And that's to set the default plane orientation where the Z is up and the base plane represents the floor. Now if you do this often, you'll definitely want to save this as another part template. It may be mentioned that Z is up in the name of the file. And then when you start new data, you can have the full arc of the 3D Experience platform in mind. Now if you need to take existing data and tweak it a bit to make it work, a little move copy body will take care of things. But again, keep the new template in mind moving forward. And now when you create parts and assemblies in SOLIDWORKS, They'll remain in that position when opened in any of the X apps. Just another one of those little things that can pay big dividends to know. I'm Darren at GoEngineer. I'll see you in one of my other tips and tricks videos. Bye for now.